Global Outreach is Harding University's way of sending our students out over the summertime to take the gospel into the whole world just like Jesus commanded us to do. And here are some of the places where our students were sent this summer. This summer I went to Thailand. Nepal and Austria. Ecuador. 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 Northern Ireland. I interned in Northern Ireland. Turkey. Albania. The interns are able to uh, use their many gifts and talents in these different places and there's a, a large variety of opportunities for them to serve as the hands and feet of Jesus. This summer we got to go to schools and teach the children English. We got to visit churches all around the country and just encourage them and be with them. And we also got to go up to Laos and learn about human trafficking and how the church is working against it. In Nepal, I got to fellowship with many people as well as work with English institutions in training people to get their visas. In Austria, I got to work with the teenagers and help lead Bible classes and take them to different activities throughout the week. The majority of our time was spent uh, traveling from the main city where we were down into the valley and doing a street evangelism where we would invite people to church and bless them with the message of Christ. We went to a newer congregation that's on the coast of Ecuador and with a group from Missouri and people from other parts of Ecuador, um, we put together an evangelistic campaign to reach out to that community. Our last week in Ecuador, actually, we got to go out to a basketball camp. Um, so our job was literally just putting on the camp with people, hanging out with the teenagers, uh, doing devotionals with our people. Um, all of us got to participate in a Devo in one sense or another. It was a really great time. This summer we helped out around their church building and we went and talked with different religious group leaders and got to ask them some questions and we helped with their holiday Bible school. For about three weeks we were also counselors at a really beautiful campsite both for boys and girls camps. Well we spent a lot of our time in the city of Antalya and we would minister to the nearby church, the St. Paul Cultural Center and something that was very prominent was learning the Turkish language and connecting to the youth. And Using that, we were able to share our testimony and spend time with them and show them what Christ looks like for some of them that didn't know. One of the things I got to do this past summer was teach English using the Bible. And I had about five to six students on average that I saw every day for about six weeks. And we got to read scripture, Old Testament, and the story of Jesus together. It was great. Committing to do something like this is certainly a daunting decision. And we understand that, but I want you to hear what some of the interns have said about the process of making that decision and also how they were blessed by it. Honestly, I'd say do it. Uh, I myself was on the fence about if I wanted to go or not, and it really just took a leap of faith. Uh, and God honestly showed me so much more than I could have imagined, so I'd say go for it. If you're interested in missions, I think you'd regret at least not asking some questions to find out more. It's a great way to dip your toes in the water for mission work and also see how the spirit moves in unique ways in a different culture. So as a fellow person who was on the fence about this, I came across this quote and it really helped me to jump in. It talked about two paths that we can take. Path one is when I know enough, then I'll go obey. But then path two was as I obey, I will grow in knowledge and insight. Take path two, I did and it was great. Go and see, Jesus is already there. Our goal in sending these students out is for the transformational experience that it is, whether they end up doing this kind of uh, ministry full time or not. And if this is something you think you might be interested in, then please go to our website at harding.edu go and you'll find out a lot of information and you'll find out also there how to apply.